Hey, what's up? Welcome back to another piano tutorial. A lot of people are saying that my last Kick and Chat video was great. People are saying I never found a tutorial how to play Kick and Chat. The other really didn't explain that well. And I learned to play piano from your... What? Hello, ghost. This is not an ascended video, please. Thank you. Anyways. The water just turned on and turned off. Jesus, that was scary. This is not an ascended video. I'm trying to make a piano video. Thank you, ghosts. You can do it later. Not today, though. I'm not filming ascended today. Anyways, so a lot of people are thinking, yeah, think of chat is great. I learned how to play this in just less than 20 minutes. It's super fun, and my friends were super amazed. <laughs> Anyways, today is another tutorial, but people were saying, hearing weird sounds. Anyways, people were saying, Giga Chat video tutorial was great, but it was too long. Mike, we do not care. Well, we honestly do appreciate you making easier versions for us who are not piano capable, but we want you to get straight to the point of the most accurate version. So I'm going to teach you two versions of the main chords of a film that had a song in there called Skyfall. If you guys do not know what Skyfall is, go search it up on YouTube, Google, whatever you use. Skyfall, Adele, you'll find the song, you'll find the thing. I'm not going to teach you the entire song of Skyfall because that thing is like four minutes long. So if you want me to teach you the entire thing of Skyfall, comment down below the entire Skyfall and I'll make a video as soon as I can. But today I'm going to show you, I'm going to teach you the most main part of Skyfall that people remember, which is usually the chorus of a song. I bet if you go to any Adele fan that is new Adele, like 2020-ish, if you ask, do you know a song called Skyfall? If they've never seen 007's James Bond Skyfall, they'll not know the song, but if they do, try to make them recite the song, and I'm pretty sure they either say they don't recognize the song, or they just say, I don't know the chorus. Because the chorus is pretty famous. It goes something like, let the sky fall. When it crumbles, we will stand tall and face it all together. I've done, if that sounds familiar, because I've done it on my channel, and you probably watched Skyfall because it has some views on it. But today I'm going to teach you how to make, play the main course of Skyfall because the, the old video is too, the whole entire song is too long. So as easy as it might sound, it's actually not that easy. This take me about three to four weeks to come up with. So as you know, usually when I play these songs, I don't look at tutorials at all. I just play them and then until it sounds right, then I do it. So here is how the chorus goes. I'm gonna play it first and explain it. So a lot of people like to play it here, but I think it's more accurate if you play it an octave lower. Don't worry about that last little thing up here. That's just some fizzazz I added. Anyways, here's how it goes. You take your thumb and your pinky and you go from the middle of the piano, which is this one, down an octave, both on C. Then you want to move your pinky and your thumb exactly how you want it. Or if that's more comfortable, use your thumb and your fourth finger. I don't know how this is more comfortable than using your pinky because there's more room to move. Move it down to an A flat or G sharp. Then move it down to an F. Then up one step to a G. Now this is the simple version. The hard version, harder version is this way. C, A flat, G, F, G. It's just one extra double G. So right, pretty easy, right? 
I mean, left hand pretty easy. Here's the right hand. So make sure that your left, left hand stays here so you know where your point of reference is. Now take your right hand and put it in the middle of the piano. So you're gonna go C, E flat, or D sharp, G. There's your first set of three notes. After that is done, move your hand down a little bit to a G sharp with your thumb, a C with your index, and an E flat with your fourth or fifth finger. Then move your hand down again to an F with your thumb, a G sharp with your index, and a C with your fourth or fifth finger. Then you want to move it up one step, put a thumb on G, index on B, and fourth finger on D. So all together is just something like this. With a hard version, you just repeat this again, but instead of going... Sorry, there was, th this is an extra one. This is from a different song. You go... It's really hard to play with the right hand, I mean the left hand after you played it for a while. But here's how it should sound. And let me fit in the lyrics so you get what it means because when the lyrics doesn't really sound like Skyfall, it just sounds like a bunch of notes mashed together. So if my singing voice is terrible, I'm sorry I have not practiced like this before. Let the sky fall when it crumbles. We will stay tall, face it all together. Let the sky fall when it crumbles. We will stay tall, face it all together. Let the sky fall. So as you see, it is just for the easier, but it's for harder than just So one of my friends after hearing my tutorial before I recorded this video said, why don't you make a harder but less accurate version? I'm like, okay, sure. Here's what I came up with. Tell me if you guys like the, this version better. I'm not sure if it's any better actually. I think it's maybe worse. Without the pedal, it's just... Only reason I decided not to teach you guys that because it sounds like an entrance to a boss battle if you do it this way. Yeah, I don't think I do this. It's just... Yeah, it sounds too much like a bass, boss battle theme of some game that I'm not going to name because I think YouTube might copyright strike me. Anyways, this is the Adele main chorus thing, piano lesson, tutorial, how to do it easy, explained. Anyways, if you want me to teach you the harder version, comment down below. If you want the entire version, comment down below. I will make those videos later, not today, because I don't usually post more than one thing. Yeah, not today, though. No.